This is a video on my Ryobi 42 inch 100 amp uh, zero turn mower. I uh, just finished the uh, transfer of the batteries from the lead acid to the lithium. Um, and this was uh, just finishing up the first cut. Um, I have a one acre lot with about three quarters of an acre of uh, grass to cut. And my lith uh, lead acid batteries would not finish three quarters of an acre of grass. Uh, that mower, when it was new, was supposed to be able to do up to uh, three acres of, of grass cutting. And it couldn't do three quarters of an acre anymore in one shot. So this one here with the new lithium batteries uh, was able to uh, finish my entire yard. And it still had a 70% charge left uh, in the batteries. So that means I can go at least two more times without charging the batteries. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think I'm going to leave it off the charger uh, until I, until next week and I cut it again just to see what happens. So needless to say, I'm really pleased with the outcome of this uh, uh, swap from uh, lead acid to uh, lithium batteries. Uh, this should give this uh, a more, uh, another several years of life, really. So that final count was 69.4% uh, and 52.62 uh, volts. So, but as we know for comparison, uh, the Ryobi uh, battery meter wasn't very, I don't want to say reliable, it wasn't very accurate, it wasn't very accurate at all. I think this one's a little bit more accurate, a little bit more predictive, and that is still a significant improvement over what I was getting. Uh, that implies that I could get at least two more mowings off this charge uh, without recharging the batteries uh, in the meantime. So this is fantastic. Um, the batteries ran fine. The grass isn't that heavy. I had a little bit of uh, uh, heavy spots that I double cut just to try and mulch it up a little bit. Uh, but it was a relatively light, light lawn. Uh, felt a little damp 
uh, could also be part of the reason that uh, uh, that the batteries, you know, took 100 pounds off of this thing. So um, it tended to seem like I spin the tires a little more, so I don't have quite as much weight on the on the rear tires for traction. But overall, I'm pretty impressed. I'm very very pleased with the way this turned out. So let's go put her away.